Saraki is a puzzle game from Crazy Soft. The main idea is to create groups of fish by breaking the ice. There are a few game modes, easy, hard, memory. There's also high score, so you can upload your scores to the internet and pick yourself against other players. And also options, so you can control how fast the game plays, sound options, and vibration, which is Zodiac specific. On the left you have the temperature meter. When this goes down to zero, it's game over, you lose. When it gets to the top, you level up and you gain more points. In the top here, you have your point display. A uh, comma meter, with us, which I'll explain in a second. And you've also got the dynamite. Um, when you're running low on um, groups of fish, you can hit that and it'll refresh the whole screen so you can start again. But pressing that will make your temperature meter go down quite a bit. Right, so the basic idea is to look for groups of large amounts of the same fish. So down the bottom there's a nice group of four green fish. So you hold the stylus down, move along them, let go, and then they just join together. You get more temperature and you get some points. Right, here's a situation where I do have groups of two, but using groups of two just makes your temperature meter go down, but it doesn't go back up because you don't score enough points. So when you get to this stage, it's best to use, if you're really at the last stages, so you can use a dynamite. And then here there's a nice big group that I can start again. If you want to create groups of big fish, you need at least more than two, you need three or more to, to get the temperature meter up. If I just continue on to get to the next level. Right, now I've leveled up and a large amount of the ice melts and I get lots of points from the fish that are unmelted. Now I will get more points for creating groups. What can happen sometimes is there's no clear group of three so what you might need to do is even though you won't give you a huge amount of temperature it's better than using the dynamite so you can link those two, link those two, link those two and there's actually a three down here as well that I can use. If I do that I'll get a lot of temperature back up. You get more points if it's large groups of the same kind so try and stick to that. Right, so hard mode is basically the same but you can see down on the left side that the temperature meter is slowly falling, so you have to think fast and get the groups. If you can, it's good to link groups together, so if you've got two groups of three next to each other, you can try doing that. Right, the way a combo works at the top. Um, after you've after you've created one group of fish, you want uh, the other fish to fall down and create another group without you having to melt any more ice. So this is a good situation where I can show that. So if I select these three, get rid of that, that will drop there, and it also gave me a combo. So the combo meter goes up, and now if I if if I create more groups of fish, I'll get more points for it. So you want to try and set up situations like that. The memory mode is a simple find the pairs game. But obviously the temperature goes down, so you've got to try and remember as try and remember exactly where they are. In this mode, the common meter works as well, so you try and create pairs straight after each other. And game over. You can then enter your score to a scoreboard. Just enter your name, and there you can see the scores from each of the easy, hard, and also memory. Um, if you hit this button down here, it exports your score. So you simply go to the website, enter that code, and you'll be able to have your score on the website against everyone else's. So that's Sarah Kinnear from Crazy Soft.